What's good, what's good, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Dre. Gotta look for this knife to open up this package. So, happy Throwback Thursday. Got me a package from Nike, you already know. Let's see. There's a bunch of stuff that actually came out recently. So I was gonna say, if you can take a guess, what do you think is in this package? Let me know. So, this right here, should give it away. Uh. Yes. So we're gonna do a quick review. One, before I do that, I ain't trying to show off a glow to anything, but look what your boy got. Look what I got today. How many of y'all took a W? Feel free to leave me a comment. Let me know. Be like, yo, you tried. You didn't get it. You got it. You know what I mean? Definitely happy. Got the size 12 woman, which is equivalent to a 10 and a half men. As to the collection. So, shout out to sneakers. You already know. I will be getting, providing you guys with a video once these come in. So, maybe by Monday, Tuesday. Stay tuned. So now, I'm going to focus on this. So, label reads out, size 11 and a half. I actually went for like one of those, I wouldn't call it a unicorn size. A unicorn would be like a 12 and a half. But, went for 11 and a half. Got lucky. Sneakers. Um, gym red, black, flint gray, white. So, for those who didn't get their pair yet or who's skeptical because... You know, sometimes it grows on people. These, right here. Let's talk about it. I think these are outstanding. I wouldn't, it's a close second. There's always like a lot of debate because you got the new colorway and then if the fence wasn't an OG, which one look better? The red definitely pops more. So, I don't have the flash on. It is all 3M, just like the flints. Um, I really, really, really like it. Damn, look at that booty. So, yeah, the back angle is just dope because you just see like it pops out a little bit. The red, the gray, the little booty crack. But um, you got a nice, thick, tumble leather. All the way up to the top. So if this was like an exact kind of like a replica of the of the uh, flint, I'm guessing this would be like an infrared, and that wouldn't really go. I don't know. I think the black is good, or if it was a gray jump man, that's also good. So yes, it reads size eleven. UK ten and a half. Europe is forty five point five. CM will be 29, BR is 43.5, and CN is 295. There's no Nike in the bottom, but it's just a jump man. Uh what can I say about these? The gray look maybe a little darker. I don't know. I gotta look at the flints, but flint gray look like a lot of different grays are used in flint grays. If y'all seen the new Air Jordan 7s come out, Flint 7s, that damn near look black. But whatever. Anyway, these are super dope. I hope you was able to grab a pair. One, the resell is low. The market is looking between what 220 and 250. But basically all the sizes. The big size is like 15, 16, 17 is going for like 270, 280. But those are like one in a million chances, like one store in your state might get one or two pairs of those. That's why those go for that much. But I was surprised because when the flints dropped, these were going for three hundred something dollars for a while. Then it stayed at like two eighty. That price was this for about two days before they release. After that, they were going for just slightly more than retail. I mean, if you do the factor in like all of the shipping, the tax, processing fees that they charge on like go and stockx, depending on your state. 
Uh, you're paying like another forty, fifty dollars on top of whatever the highest bid offer would be. So if you pay, if you offer like what two hundred twenty dollars, you're gonna you end up paying like two sixty five around there. So it's not bad for a very, very, very clean shoe. Let me give you some more angles on it. So this is its true red form it's a vibrant red let's check it out in the sun so you can get another angle yeah definitely a nice vibrant red that's that tumble i was telling you about you already seen the bottom which remind me of like the cherry 13s obviously this would be a red to suede but see oh man i love this camera but yeah, this is like, it's true color. I'll try to see if we can catch it in a little bit of shade. See if we can see a little bit of the reflector. But, um, oops. Now you dropped it. Doesn't matter. You get it either way. But these is cool. I hope you were able to pick up a pair. You were able to purchase a pair for somebody else if you think they like it. These is definitely fire. So... Let me know, what do you honestly rate these on a scale of 1 to 10? If I give the flints a 10, I give you like a 9, 9.5. I'm not going to give a newer colorway a better. Well, they are better OG. How can I put this? You do have newer colorway for some sneakers that actually are better than some OG colorway shoes. But these, close second. My favorite 13s in the rank of, let's see. Flint or old school name French Blue or they actually named it the Navies then you have the Black and Reds then you have the Higa Games these will be right behind it then you have the Wheat then you have I think it's a Carolina it's like a light gray with the baby blue sole upper is leather those are dope and let me see what the 13s were dope the black and blue, that's cool. I like that, the black and blue one. But anyway, not trying to bore y'all. I showed you the one shoe. Shout out to me with the Air Jordan 11s, women's. But yeah, guys, show me some love. Feel free to smash that like button. Feel free to subscribe to me. It's because they rescribe. Feel free to subscribe to me. Show me that good old love. We're May. I'm trying to hit 4,500 total subscribers for this month. That's my goal. So if you want to, you know, spread my love, share out my videos, and keep smashing that like button. Truly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Thanks for checking out my videos, and I'll hit you till next time. One we'll love y'all. Shout out to my West Indians today. Party. Kirby Knight. NYC.